uh, during President HH's uh, last press briefing for this year, you know, when he talked about how Zambia now has started exporting fertilizer to neighboring countries, I was very, very happy and very, very excited because I thought to myself that this is a great uh, uh, breakthrough. So, to my greatest surprise, I came across one of uh, Mr. Kasundimwenda's uh, uh, posts uh, where he talked about how the whole thing is a lie. And he said he doesn't know if um, if people are lying to President HH or it's just part of the lie. So I was very surprised because personally I thought that, okay, this is a great breakthrough. Now we, are, we, we have not started exporting fertilizer to neighboring countries. So we're going to generate more revenue and we're going to maybe produce more fertilizer and all that. But I was so surprised. Let's listen, listen to this. Let's listen, listen to this. Today I hate President Akande Chilema talking about Zambia exporting fertilizer. I didn't know that this day and age people can lie to a president and he believes. President Akande Chilema, people are lying to you. They are lying to you. But the problem is I don't know whether they are lying to you or you are part of the lie. Because you and me know too well that Zambia does not manufacture fertilizer for export. But today, during the press briefing, you told us about how you met your fellow president and you gonged them that we're exporting. Let us tell you, I, for one, I personally went to United Capital Fertilizer. I went there. I had a meeting with United Capital. I toured that facility. If you haven't toured, my brother, go and tour. You are giving loans, uh, contracts to United Capital Fertilizer to supply fertilizer. You should have asked them, where are they getting that fertilizer? Where are they getting that fertilizer? You should have asked them. Instead of you, President, going on a press briefing and saying things which are not true. Let me tell you what is happening to fertilizer. Don't be misled, my President. Don't be misled. Some of us will have you will tell you the truth. There is a company known as OPC. Sherifian Des Phosphates. This is a Moroccan company that makes fertilizer. OCP. Sherifian Des Phosphates. That's the name of this company that makes fertilizer. It has opened a distributor in, in Mozambique. I know you know these things, but you chose to be flowing with the lies. I don't know who you, you are trying. I, well, President, I know you love being cool. And when you meet your fellow president, last time you told us that uh, your fellow president are asking how you have resolved the country, how you have become so great. I know you want the big talk. But that big talk, you only deliver it when you work hard. Me, I'm a hard worker. And I believe in working hard, not telling stories. Today you told us no more stories. But I can tell you, you told us more stories today than all the stories you have told us since you became president. Today you told us more stories that are false and are not true. People you are thinking are producing fertilizer, my president, are not producing fertilizer. They are pre-packaging. They have been taking Amasa, Karitin, Ipijki, Watwati, Omiombo, whatever. They take Amasaka sacks. They take them to a distributory in Mozambique. This is a sublet company of OCP. OCP is a very big um, uh, fertilizer manufacturing company based in Morocco. It accounts for 31% of the world fertilizer market share. It has got 31%. So let me tell you. People are getting fertilizer from Morocco, already manufactured. They are manufacturing there because Morocco is one of the major producers of phosphates. And phosphates are the major ingredients in fertilizer. No, 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 President, no, 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 The same way, no, 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 they are lying to you. I know they will tell you, no, Kasonde is mad. Is, but they are lying to you. They told Sata is mad. Even you, they used to tell you you are mad. Maybe Tamare Umfafi. People who say the truth, even Jesus, when you speak the truth, people will insult you. So those people are clapping for you. You say you come on Facebook. I hope you are listening. I know they are giving you reports. Those are fake reports. As we collaborate with these people, we know about these contracts. They are taking sacks, ama sacks, ama empties, empty sacks. And they are taking to this company from Mozambique for them to be filled in with fertilizer. And they bring it in Zambia, retail manufactured in Zambia, and you are failing for that line. They can produce to my, to my fertilizer, no, no, but not to full capacity. Those are decorations. 
votes are not enough. Even when you go to United Capital Fertilizer, even them, they are buying from this same company. Let them not lie to you. Yes, they import a few phosphates from China. They bring, but those are not what they are selling. So even when they are exporting, for all information, they are just using Zambia as a conduit for export. Not that they are making that here. If we want to be exporting fertilizer, President Akanecha, let me tell you what you need to do. Zambia has got phosphates reserves in Chipata. We have phosphate here in Zambia. And you acknowledge that it is taking Zambians themselves to discover gold in, in Impika, to discover gold in Kasenseri, to discover... Now we are telling you, if, if you ask the experts, we will tell you, we have got phosphates. Start digging phosphates and start manufacturing fertilizer. You're not fresh, you have, we are not manufacturing fertilizer. How can you manufacture fertilizer when you don't even have the basic ingredients? How can you be importing phosphates to be manufacturing fertilizer and exporting when you imported phosphates. You think other countries can't import phosphates also and manufacture? What is so special about Zambia that we should be able to sell to those friends you are, you are misleading? You are misleading those people. Of course you are going to sell. And it is because we are not manufacturing phosphates in Zambia. That's why the price of fertilizer cannot go down, my president. If we were manufacturing fertilizer in Zambia, remember, President, you are an economist, you should have known that the price of fertilizer would have gone down, would be buying fertilizer 50 kg, even 100 kwacha, or even 500 kwacha, would have been buying even 200 kwacha. But how can you be buying fertilizer 1,100 when you are then being manufactured here? The problem is they are lying to you, and you are buying in the lies. You said you are found on social media. I hope you are listening. I hope you are listening because if of ever issue what is happening, you are wondering whether you believe those lies or you are deliberately choosing to lie. I hope for the latter. I hope you were just being misled. The same way the health minister misled you that uh, there is medicine in hospital present. You can send a person to go and check it. You need to ask the minister to tell you whether there is medicine and even ask on TV and she lies to you and we are all watching. She tells you, no, there's 80 to 90, and you also start parroting that. Sure. Uh -huh. In Nyimba, there are phosphates in Nyimba. Thank you very much. They are... You know, sometimes I really wonder where ZMBC is. Does ZMBC journalists go anywhere to cover important things at all? Because if the government has embarked on projects like, like this, like projects where they are producing fertilizer and you know, all these things these are the things that we expect them to go and cover come and show us okay this is what the government is doing look at this this is this plant you know but i don't know maybe i just maybe i just missed it on the news or something the ZM, if zm bc can be uh, showing us these kind of things we wouldn't even be coming here to argue on the internet whether it is true the government has indeed uh, started producing fertilizer and exporting to other uh, neighboring countries or people like us on the window is just lying so personally, I don't even know what to make out of, what to make out of this. I don't know if Kason Demwenda is lying or uh, President HH is being lied to or President HH has all the information is, is telling the truth. I don't even know what to make out of this because I tried to check out for comments. You know, there were some people like this guy who were saying that uh, he, he, he clears trucks that take fertilizer to Botswana. Then there are other people who are putting in negative comments saying President HH is, is, is not is not being lied to, is part of the lie. You know, there are all these other things. Everything just crazy and complicated anyway. So let me know what you think or what is your, what your take is on this. Let me know in the comment section below. And if you're not subscribed to this channel, please kindly subscribe and leave a like for the algorithm. And also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that each time I drop new videos, you get notified.